Ladies and gentlemen, hello to the official RBG Esports stream for RLCSX uh, Spring Regional 2. Took us a while to get back into RBG or to get into Rocket League, but RBG is finally here. Very excited. I am going to be your host tonight, Randomize, and with me is the one and only Captain Icefire. Captain, how you doing, buddy? I'm doing good, man. How about yourself? Good. I am so stoked and excited, and I did not mean that in a pun anyway at all, uh, but I'm very excited to be back in Rocket League. We're here. We're back. Finally. It took us forever, uh, but you know, we wanted to make sure we found the right team uh, before we got back in and when we got to talk to the boys sit down with mile money and stokely and just hear um uh, kind of their background and how they view rocket league and how they view being a part of an organization it, honestly our lines just matched up perfectly i couldn't be even more happy to just sign this team i'm very excited and uh it's just it's nice to finally be back captain you're you're a content creator for rbg mm -hmm. um so for you you're probably really happy to be here with us casting some rocket league huh i'm i'm over the moon to be back in well not only a content creation um the aspect of rbg but also being uh, a caster um i'm really privileged to be here uh i appreciate it and when the announcement came out earlier today that we had uh, brought on a new rocket league team i couldn't be more ecstatic i was really really excited i was like yes dude finally we can get back into into some competitive rocket league Mm -hmm. yeah no i'm it just feels good to be back it, it kind of feels like being back home you know uh when we when we were able to send uh pretty much a notification out to everyone on twitter saying hey we are back in rocket league and the amount of welcome we got was just i couldn't appreciate it any more than we got today so thank you to the community of rocket league for welcoming us home Honestly, it's just so exciting. But let's talk about this game. First match of the night uh, is RBG versus G2 Esports. Remember, Drez is now playing uh, since Rizzo has retired. We've got to see some action out of Drez and everything. Uh, G2, definitely a fierce team. Looking back at how they did, though, uh, during the first split, they, they, looked, um, they looked pretty good. They made it to the semifinals. And... Out of everyone in our group, they were the only ones to do it, but they got taken out. But it looks like we got the game going already. Game one on the way as we talk about everything going on. G2 will be in the blue. RBG in the orange and starting off the game. We're already one up. I, you see, I was uh, I was about to say we're gonna have to really see the boys come out and try to shut down these passing plays from G2 that they're so well known for. It's gonna be a very interesting game, but we're already starting off very very strong. Uh, I mean, this is the way you want to start it. This is exactly how you want to start it. You're coming in. It's uh, I believe this is like this roster of sub uh, coming in first time and to open it up against G2 like that. You want to boost your confidence right away, and this is definitely how you're going to do it. Absolutely. Two players of GNAPs, uh, or sorry, of G2 up. JNAPs is going to hold this one. Pass off the backboard and a save. Money. Able to get this one out into the corner. Chicago playing this one slowly. Two players of RBG in the corner. A little scary there. But a good play and breakaway for them. Dre is up. Going to hit this one off the backboard, straight down, yeah, and G2 is going to put that one in. We're tied up already. That was a scary situation for uh, for the RBG boys, that coming off that top uh, that top part, coming straight down into the waterfall, putting that right in front of J-Naps. That's okay, though. It we, is. We got we to gotta feel the water out. That's all it is. RBG, the boys... They're, they're putting on their, their new virtual jerseys. We haven't sent one to them yet. But, you know, they, they got their club now, the RBG game in front. They're just, they're feeling it out. They got to they gotta get into the new skin. And we are all here at RBG, and uh, just everyone, we're all rooting for them. Oh, easily. Easily. And uh, I got to say, I'm definitely keeping an eye out on my boy Stokely. Oh! 
goal from G2, though. Well, but definitely looking at my boy Stokely in the tri-state area with me, so very excited about that yeah, one. That was, That's I, think, I think we're all just excited. All, I think all of us are just ex extremely excited to be back. I'm I'm excited to be back and just supporting the supporting the boys again. Oh yeah, for sure. Stokely, with a nice air dribble. Stop at midfield. Dreyas is going to continue with that money. Stopping him in the corner. JNAP's shot on target. No one home at RPG Esports. That's you, you, you start with an amazing opener to then no one in the net. That's a little scary, but you know, first, re uh, first regional, no, regional number two for these boys. Just got to feel it out. It's, it's scary. It might be a little nerve-wracking. Oh, yeah. Uh, coming under a new name, they definitely don't want to uh, to disappoint, but uh, I think I think they got it. They're just going to warm they're going to warm up a little bit. They uh, I think they've got it. They're going to they're going to get their their stride going here. We love them no matter what. They don't have to worry about impressing the new org. We have already seen what they can do. Oh, Stokely with an open net though. G2 taking a book out of RPG's uh, defense at the beginning of this game. Leaving that net wide open, pulling the goalie out. Uh, uh, this is not snow day, right? We are playing the soccer version? I think so. I okay. think so. <laughs> I'm just making sure I, I, you know, pulling the goalie out like that much. A little scary. <laughs> Trying but, to look for that extra player, maybe. Oh, yeah. I mean, G2's up. Uh, up by one now. At the time, they had their cushion goal. It's gone now, only leading by one. Two players of RPG up, able to get blocked. Starkly there. In the net, able to hit this one into the corner. Now, going to follow this one up. Dreyas stopping him with the 50. Mile just buying some time for the players to rotate back, get some boost in, in the tank. Dreyas is going to now take a shot at this. It's high and a clear away. Chicago hits this one up. Miles looking to pass this one middle. Money down to Stokely. Stokely keeping this one off the backboard. Money getting blocked by Dreyas for that pass play. Miles going to try to look to get this one centered. JNAP's just holding this one nicely. Money's going to put this back center. Stokely just looking for any opportunity for that shot. He's just waiting for it. Miles setting up the flip reset towards the shot. Puts that one in. We're all tied up. What a crazy play by them, keeping the pressure on G2. Definitely a hard team to keep that kind of pressure on, but he's able to come off that backboard and get that dunk. Oh, my God. I mean, it's mild. We've seen the ones plays he can do, and, and now he's just showing off on the new team. I, I, I need to see another one, Mile. Do that again. I, I wasn't. I, I, something was in my eye. <laughs> I need to see it again. Yeah, do it again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, speaking of again, shots on the RPG net. Good saves, though. Dre's passing the center for Chicago. Off the back. Mile now has a little bit of time. Ball got a little too far from him. Yeah, the RBG boys were looking a little low on boost there. Hopefully that won't affect him too much. Not panicking too much, but by Stokely. Oh, you can see he's not panicking at all, catching it right in front of the net like that. Good block by the two RBG members there, Chicago. Off the backboard. Stokely able to clear this one out. Two players of RPG getting demoed. It's all up to money at the moment. Pass to Dreyas. Off the side ball. Trying to get a center for anyone at G2. In the middle, he blocks his own teammate. JNAPS off the backboard. Chicago with the shot low. Stokely able to get a good save there. G2 just all over the RPG side right now. Strong offense coming out, but... The defense of RBG bending but not breaking. Jane Apps with a flip reset. And Stokely reads it and saves the day. It's a great block there by Stokely. That could have turned into a very dangerous situation if he hadn't read that properly there. Marco now He's gonna do it all on his own against Mile Mile. Holding this one up, gets it away from the net in time before Chicago gets there. Money clearing it out. Jane Apps waiting in midfield. Into the corner. Stokely now trying to clear it. Coming down to the last 10 seconds. And it's only game one, and we may be looking into going to overtime. Put it in the corner. Great play by him. Money up. Gets this one out. Dreas is going to try to keep this one up. 
JNAPS is there, hits the ground, overtime, game one. First time RBG is back, and the boys are making a sweat. Come on. I'm I'm just I'm happy that they're doing this this is amazing. I don't expect anything less. They're they're doing fantastic keeping this G2 team at bay. Oh, Mile getting over to the G2 defense. They can't seem to get this ball centered. Money looking to try to get in the way of Dreas. Dreas, can we follow that one up? Low on boots, J Naps. Going to put this back in the corner. Mile is already there. Passes to Stokely. Chicago beats him to it. Dre is up. Going to look to actually take the shot for that one. Money gets this one centered to Stokely. Stokely to Money. Money looking for the backboard play. Stokely going to keep control of this on the G2 side. Great fake on Chicago. Gets it under JNAPS, but JNAPS got a little touch on it. That ball bounced really high. Mile. Oh, RVG now trying to really keep an aggressive front on the G2 side over a minute into our first game over. Uh, and just a little bit of a back and forth, back and forth. The players are respecting each other, but they're respecting each other with a little bit of aggression. I would say it's kind of like having, you know, some nice Cajun fries, but you're not putting too much spice in. You just gotta, you gotta feel it out first. <laughs> it's like a, it's like Thai food or something. You know, you try to go for the mild, and then you're like, you know what? I could spice it up a little bit. I, I haven't had dinner yet, so can you tell I'm hungry? <laughs> <laughs> Just talking about food. Let's go. Talking about some food. Chicago. Pass to JNAPS. JNAPS going to try to get this flip reset a little high. But Dreas there. Back for a double touch. Going to try to leave it one more time. Mile. Out to Stokely. Looking to try to get a counterattack, but Money gets demoed. JNAPS to the middle. Double commit there double by G2. Commit. That's what we like to see on RBG. And that's waiting in the middle mile. And Stokely double commit there, but with the power of friendship, we can get that ball out pretty far. Stokely off the backboard. Dreas gets a huge clear. No one on RBG on that side. Money. Oh, I'm not sure if he wants to fake that or he just missed it, but it was a collision between the two players. Stokely towards the net. Money looking for the redirect. Chicago gets that one away. JNAPS now clearing this out to Chicago. Counterattack play. Pass center to Treyes. Treyes dribbles. Backboard play. Pass. Oh, and a save a from Money coming from money. under. It That's the kind of defense we're looking for. Oh, yeah. I mean, these guys are just mechanically insane, especially on the defensive end. We, we saw we saw Mile in some crazy defensive clips in the 1v1 tournament uh, during the break. But then, Money being able to pull that off, taking a page out of Mile, coming under the ball and still getting a huge save off the backboard. Chicago is going to clear this one away. Stokely to try to keep control. JNAPS doesn't have anyone in the center. Low boost. Chicago set up for him now. Two players of RPG in that corner, but able to get this one out in the middle. Money, only one here. Backboard, and able to money. get a good save there. This is a scary first situation, no! both on backboard. Yeah, I was just about to say, we're still in overtime in game one, but three minutes and 30 seconds in, G2 will take game one. Definitely um, definitely a really good first game for uh, for the RPG boys. I mean, three, three minutes, 30 second overtime is definitely got to take a toll on you after a little while. Huh. Why is it in the corner like that? Technical difficulties. Screen come back. <laughs> Screen come back. <laughs> yeah, but uh, hey, hey, game one. Game one. Starting that off like that. It was a very powerful game one, uh, showing exactly what RBG can do. Oh, yeah. I mean, the amount of aggression coming out of all the players has just been fantastic. It, it, I think we were just 15 seconds into game one, and we got our first goal uh, for region two. So, I mean, come on. We can't really complain too much after that one. I feel like they got their, their sea legs on them now. They're ready to they're ready to rock and roll in game two, I, th I feel. Oh, yeah. Chat, we're going we're gonna to need something from you, though, chat. We need you to come up with something. You know those little rhyme things that people do uh, where they, you know, like – 
It's like spam uh, this. Spam this fishy or something. Yeah, for yeah. Wishy, yeah. <laughs> Come on, we need something. Send us something. RBG playing extremely close. Yes, Landon, definitely have been. Uh, we have a quick technical pause. And, uh, ooh, JNAP's having a little bit of an internet problem over there. But once that is uh, completed, we'll get back into this one. Um, but, Captain, I mean, we have three games today that we're going to be mm -hmm. watching, not just this one. It looks like, oh, it looks like we might have to get a new server. Um, but we have three games today. We have the game right now with G2, then we're going to be playing PK, and then we're going to finish the day with NRG. I mean, can we talk about a sweaty day? <laughs> yeah, I mean, d d despite it being extremely hot outside and sweaty, quite literally, we are sweating in some Rocket League games, and it's fantastic to see, man. I was I was so excited earlier. I was I was giggling like a freaking school uh, schoolgirl to see the the boys back in the uh, back in rotation in RLCS again. Yeah, I mean, definitely can say that. So after we just saw that game one. You, you're up in that rank. You you definitely know some high level Rocket League gameplay. Um, how do you feel that game went for RBG? I mean, we we started off strong, then we were back on defense for majority of the time, and then we had to bounce mm -hmm. back. So, uh, what? How do you feel that? Like, what what made that game happen to last so long? Uh, I feel like it was solid defense from both teams that uh, that ended up causing uh, that game to go on for so long. I mean, one clear after another from both ends of the spectrum, just slapping it back and forth like it's ping pong, right? So I feel like that's what caused that game to go on for so long. Um, and I feel like a lot of the problems that RBG was having was a couple of double commits here and there uh, that kind of threw them off, or maybe one person was going for boost while the other one wasn't quite ready to be back or you know something like along those lines from what I had seen. Yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, all we can do is wait and see how the next game goes. It's a best of five. Plenty of room, plenty of time to see what we can get going. Um, have we got anything from the chat? Any ideas? We got some awesome subs. Thank you for the prime subs, everybody. We really do appreciate the support coming out, everyone. Uh, but we are currently in a technical difficulty seems that one of the players on G2 was having a uh, problem with their with their internet it just it pinged up to like 600 so i am currently waiting to get the next invite which i did and uh yeah hopefully get this game back going nothing quite like internet issues and if anyone knows internet issues it would be freaking me <laughs> Oh, yeah. I deal with internet issues all the time. Oh, I know. Hopefully it's just not the server uh, kind of messing with uh, JNAPs. So. Yeah, no, I, I, it looks like things are back to normal. We're in a new server. They're all feeling it out. And then we're going to get this uh, show continuously going. Um, I mean, chat, if this is going to be a thing, you know, we got Regional 3 coming up after this. Uh, tonight's the only night we're allowed to stream for RLCS, but if there's something you personally would love to see happen on the RBG stream during the Rocket League matches, you know, when we make uh, Regional 3, let us know. You can say it here in the chat. Go to our Discord channel. I think there's a code, uh, exclamation point Discord. Join us there. Let us know what you want to see over here. Do you want more of a serious uh, casting style? Do you want more laid back? You know, let us know. And uh, we'll get that up and running for you and everything. So here we go. It looks like game number two is about to be on the way. Hashtag fear the Panthers. Spam that in the Twitch chat. For anyone just joining, we are in the round one of the group stages. Five, five rounds. Each team will have one bye. Our bye is tomorrow. We're in game number two, G2, one in overtime at three minutes and 30 seconds. And, uh, we're starting. Looks like we're starting out this game with uh, with G2 scoring right off the kickoff. I mean, hey, if we're just gonna if we're just gonna flip how it happened last game, I'll take that because then we'll win this game. Yeah, there we go. 
Just uh, flipping it around a little bit. That's, that's all there is to it. Oh, money though. Shot my money. With a money shot right in over the player's head. That was, uh, that was a good pass and set up by, the, uh, by Miles getting that little bit of a 50 there, setting that play up for money. Just a banger of a shot into net. Chat, go into the G2 chat, and every time, every time money's got a money shot, you gotta let him know in the G2 chat. You gotta give some love to the other words, of course, but maybe, uh, maybe some little rivalry going too. Oh, good. I think it'll be good. Ooh, Stokely though. Just looking for that shot. Chicago, that's clear this one out. Mile, you ready to see Mile pull off one sick shot? Almost the second one, Jane Abs with the save. Stokely just missing the shot as well. Money, good control by him. Stokely is there to help him out. A clear counter play. Mile with a beautiful save. Jane Abs now shooting on target. Stokely clears this over to Mile. Some say uh, Mile went that extra mile to get that save. Uh. <laughs> oh no, are the puns coming back? Are we really gonna be starting? I, I, you know, I'm not really that stoked uh, to have some puns coming. Back. Oh God, <laughs> the dad jokes are coming. You know, I always mess with chat about the, the dad jokes. I, so I guess I'm just kind of a hypocrite for that one. <laughs> Even Chad's reacting to the nice dad jokes. Good pass by Money to Stokely. <laughs> Jane Epps able to read that in time. Chicago looking to bring this one right down the middle. Looking, I'm not sure if he was looking for a teammate or not there, but no one was giving him the room. I guess he probably called to do it on his own. Andreas bumping Mile. Stokely trying to clear this one out. That is a dangerous drop right down the middle. Good save by Mile. Ooh, shot on target. Or close to target, I should say. And JNF takes out Stokely. Money. Trying to clear this one out. G2 just in the RBG face right now. Again, we're looking at a very similar situation. We're just having that, that ping pong effect again where we're getting clears back and forth between the teams. But it looks like everyone's feeling pretty comfortable there. Yeah, Chicago. Oh, wow! Okay. What a shot by <laughs> by Chicago, though. Oh, that's great. Getting that top corner. Oh yeah, great redirect into the you know, that top wood, putting that one in. Uh, I was a little scary. I didn't think that was gonna go in. I thought that was gonna bounce out. I mean, if it was me, it would bounce out. So I just yeah, my shot. <laughs> <laughs> I see it hit crossbar. I automatically think it's going out. <laughs> it's just the, the luck of the draw. Exactly. Mile up in the air, passing it. Stokely was rotating out, so he wasn't able to help him out there. Money to Mile. Grace. Guys flew that one away. Miles still meet him in the middle. Jane Epps with a 50. Chicago ends up hitting that one down center. But a light touch from Stokely, so that ball did not come fiercely down. Money, though. Jeez. These guys being able to stop the ball backwards, it's just amazing. The, the mechanical prowess of these high level players like you said earlier like i'm pretty high ranked but i'm still nowhere near the mechanical abilities of anyone at this rank yeah oh a little rough there not exactly sure what happened but dre has passed that one center stokely in the back money came right down the I middle i think he was missing oh mile got demoed so they probably threw off the rotation too yeah he was just spawning back in that corner and it was just an unfortunate bounce right into the uh, right into the center field. Oh man, G2 coming with the guns out. Just demos left and right. Stokely off the backboard. Chicago clears this one away. To Jane Apps. Mile there already. Ooh, fakes out Chicago or just ran out of boost. One or the other. Off the backboard. Money with the shot! The Money shot, shot into go. the left side. RBG not out of this one yet. Only down by one with a minute and a half to go. That strong shot off that backboard uh, really, really set up the play there for money and able to take advantage of uh, just the the landing of the, the G2 players there. Reyes off kickoff, looking to center this one up, Mile. Getting up with this ball, got Stokely to help him out. Jay Nats with a soft clear, Stokely trying to get that one around and get a center. Chicago hits this one out to center. Mile intercepts. Mile there again. 
Stokely centering this one up as Dre is going to clear this one away. All three players of RBG right there at the, at the line. That was a little scary. Couldn't even think about what I was saying because I, <laughs> I got a little nervous there. <laughs> The, the attempted shot there by uh, by Stokely, not quite able to make that one happen, but he's going again. Ooh, Got a is. lot of pressure going on here. Oh yeah, great pressure. I mean, when you're at midfield, what, uh, midfield, that ball hung out there for a while. Yeah, but. everyone. We had a G2 player chasing an RBG player around the field. It looked like it was Mile chilling out in the backfield, getting chased. It goes by J Naps. Left that ball in the middle of the field for for a hot second there. Mile up, out to Stokely. Stokely. So try to control this down to Mile. Ten seconds left. RBG. They need to get one more and bring this into an overtime again. You can expect G2 to be all over them. Chicago puts that one right down. And 2-0. Uh, Time for uh, reverse sweep, I would say, yeah. Reverse sweep time, chat. Reverse sweep time. Still close games, though. Honestly, the amount of pressure that G2 put on RPG and the fact that we're only down by one is honestly... That's pretty solid. Yeah, no, that's solid. It's very solid. It's very good. And, oh, God, I just I can't wait to see, like, down the line how these guys do, especially because of... There is such a high ceiling gap of skill for these guys that I, you know, this is the new and improved RBG right now. Wait till next regional and the next season. It's mm -hmm. it going to get scary. So I'm excited for that. Yeah, I was. I love watching Mile go up for them aerials. He is always in the air. Like that dude is. I think most of the time he has the ball, he's in the air with it. Yeah. No, I. I mean, Miles got that like he's got a really good like ones mechanic and like and that's something I just love because when he's up there, he's got enough boost for it. He gets pretty scared. Speaking of scary, he almost had a quick goal succession off the kickoff right at the end of this game three. It was almost like deja vu all over again from that last game. Deja vu of the deja vu. Yeah, it's like deja vu -ception. Naps. We're gonna take a shot at this one. Trey is being a little scary in the back. No, no Stokely. Ooh. Not quite able to get up to that save was Stokely. I mean, they were just bombarding RBG with shots there. Chicago able to get that right under Stokely and make it a 1 0 lead. Yeah, I mean, we're, we're seeing it over and over again. G2 just really have that kind of aggression. They're just constantly looking to pound the back. Uh, of the wall or the back of the net until the defense breaks. But Stokely says, I don't even need to be in your face to take a shot. I'm just going to shoot from my side. That was a banger of a shot. That thing came cruising off. I don't think Dreyas was ready for it, and Jnops yeah. wasn't quite able to get back to it in time to make that a, a, a save. Yeah, he, he caught Dreyas creeping up. That's exactly what you want to do, too. You, know, you want to shoot that to the back end of the car. Shot by Jnops. Off the side, Stokely clearing this one away. Plenty of time for Dre. Dre's Dre going to have to hit this one up. Money. Going to drop this one down to Stokely. Chicago gets in the way. Chicago still trying to hold this one off. Dre's clears this one away. No one in RBG back. This is not looking good. Oh, a shot. Mile almost saw the opportunity, but couldn't get back in time. G2 up by one. A little bit of a double commit there by uh, by Money and Stokely. Kind of put Mile in a two-on-one position. Just wasn't the, the best uh, place to be, but we still believe. We believe. Oh, yeah. And it was uh, that's a rough one because it wasn't just... Oh, what is it? It wasn't just coming back for Mile just to do it on his own. He's doing it with, like, no boots. Oh, a little double commit again. That's gonna be Chicago. one thing that they're gonna have to get under control if they're gonna want to. Uh, if they're gonna want to beat G2 and take uh, take the reverse sweep, is they're gonna have to watch those double commits. Center play hitting out, mile and money. Money helps them out there. Stokely now at midfield. 
We'll get the second touch. Pass to Chicago instead. Money. Clears this one from Mile. Shot towards net. J Naps already there. And a counter play already coming into play. Stokely able to hit this one up high. Money clearing it away. Chicago is going to put this back on the back wall of RBG. Money. RBG looking to do a counter play. Money's up. It's going to be off the backboard. A little awkward for Stokely. Ooh, and all of the G2 defense able to get back in time. Money. Playing in the corner here. Cannot beat Reyes to that ball. Mile. Gets this one down off J Naps awkwardly, but Chicago was there for him. Now on the counter push, but then he immediately just taken down by Dreyaz. Yeah, no, G2 is playing really smart. They're they're starting to notice that uh, RPG are looking for those counter passes, and they're they're keeping their third man back a little bit farther. I think they they start to notice a lot of the a lot of the reasons why RPG has been able to get goals, which is just catching that third man off guard, creeping up a little bit too far, or any reason for that. So now they're playing with a third man back, and that's really hurting all the opportunities that RBG's looking for. RBG's, you know, they, they, they're, bang, they're banging the ball over to the offensive side, uh, but then they start to lose control of it. it it's that hard. Do, do we keep the ball close, bring it up, or do we try to bang it out and go for a counterplay? Stokely off the bar, could not find that one. That was such a close shot by Stokely. I was really hoping that just that little double commit by G2 was enough to completely throw uh, throw off uh, the the defense and just get that pressure on G2. A lot of demos starting to come out of RBG. I mean, that's exactly what you got to do. When your third man is back, when the third man is back on your the other team, you need to start hitting them with the demos. But, or you could just go for a pass play like G2 did. <laughs> Yeah, what a what a pass up by J Naps right to Chicago. Mile wasn't able to get underneath and uh, take him out in time. Now with a two with a two goal lead. Yeah, with just a little bit over a minute left, this is uh, looking a little rough for RBG. But I mean, it's, it's the first game of the night, and it's there's four games in total you can play in your group. So as long as they as long as they can beat someone, they won't get knocked out of group. Yeah, yeah we have uh, we have PK tonight, and NRG is our last game of the night. Yeah, and then, then we first Ghost. Ghost Gaming tomorrow uh, in the actual RLCS broadcast at twitch.tv slash rockerly or the B stream that you can see. Uh, I'm not too worried. I'm not too worried. I had a few words with uh, Glando. I don't know how I feel about the game with the uh, RPG and PK. I just got to gotta mess with the with the homies every once in a while, you know? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> got to let them know that we're coming. Yes, sir. 20 seconds left, though. At this point, RPG needs to just put something in it. What a play. Coming in. I wasn't even ready for that one. Mile is ready to play. He is getting the passing plays. He's taking the shots and he is scoring the ball. He is just going. And Stokely playing a little bit of Mario over there and getting a Goomba Andreas, or at least it looked like it from that camera angle. What a what a passing play and what a play in general by the by the boys. Oh yeah. I mean, we got 10 seconds left. We're in there, desperation mode in the last 10 seconds. There is, have to put another there's a one chance, in. though. There's a chance, though, on the offensive play. JNAP clears this one away. Money is there. Going to have to keep this one up high. Gray is already up with the preemptive the defensive play. So, Blake. Oh, but couldn't oh. get that one out. A rough one there. Yeah, that's a 3-0. But, I mean, come on. How close of a match can you ask for that it was just even like the, the, that's one of the things i hate is that the series never speaks for the games themselves and that is one of the most annoying things that you can you know you you deal with as a team as players and everyone you know yeah it was a, it was a 3-0 sweep rough every game was a one goal game you, you can't get mad. Game one was a three minute and 30 seconds. We come out of the gate and keep the game tied for so long. Uh, you can't ask for like anything better. You know, 
this is a, it's still like it's still a good way to start this uh, start this regional. I personally feel for the underdog team to come in. You know, I I feel this is really a good start. Being one goal difference every game. Now we just take what we got here. We're gonna move on to our next game, and we're gonna you know just apply at all all the best plays that worked and try to put that against PK and anything that we did wrong we put it back with the G2 game and we move on to PK but yes that's going to be our next game which will be RBG versus PK uh, Pittsburgh Knights that'll be coming up next we're going to take a short break and then we'll be back with more Rocket League action after this so don't go anywhere we'll be right back <laughs> 